Hey guys, I'm here to show you how to turn these beautiful brown boots I got from Poshmark to boots more like Supergirl. But before I do that, I have some progress for you when it comes to Supergirl. First, I want to show you the new color of the wig. This is new because I changed it since my last video right there. And this is the final official color. It is fully painted and so is my hand. It got really crunchy um, because I put so many different layers of paint on it. So now what I did was I steamed it so when you steam it, it gets straighter and it loses the texture, or not texture, it loses the curl of it because it just makes it straight. These are my car glasses. So with Supergirl coming back, I'm going to always represent her this way when I do my recaps of the show. These have no lenses because reflections. Another thing I wanted to show you is I got the fabric. The fabric. Not all of it, but some of it. This is my cape fabric. It's leather on one side and then not leather on the other side. So I don't have to worry about lining it, which is super awesome and it's so stretchy and it's just amazing. I got all this fabric from downtown LA and then the blue fabric, guys, it's so perfect that I'm so sad that I don't have it in red because I have to find a red one. Look at it. Look at all of its beautifulness and its stretchiness. Yes, I have on a Hawkeye shirt because represent this fabric is the best thing ever i will show you in a different video when i start cutting it up which fab which fabric which patterns i'm going to be using where i eventually get the red ones but i'm not ready to do that i wanted to do all the little stuff with like painting the boots which you're about to see but i'm gonna stop talking all right now time to start painting i am using the angelus brick and matte furniture which i bought on ebay i will link it down below but i am painting the boots with the sponge brush because I figured that is working the best and I ended up doing about four layers and towards the end I mixed in regular water-based red acrylic paint because it was just a too deep of a red but I don't think it really made a difference at all so that may or may not have been a waste of paint. But once I started doing the mat, I accidentally spilled way too much, and then I just ended up using a paper towel. But yes, that is a finished look, and I am one step closer to being Supergirl. Monday, Supergirl's back, and it's time to watch Kara kick butt. If you want to see more videos of me becoming Supergirl, some of you guys already said I am, but I will be continue showing you different things. I want to do separate videos for builds, unlike Doctor Strange where I did the full thing instead of decided. I don't know. Every cosplay I make, I'm going to show something different because I'm going to be doing something different for each thing. And if I keep showing you, then I'm going to cut out fabric every single time. How exciting is that, actually? <laughs> be sure to hit the subscribe button if you want to see more videos from me and do all that fun stuff. Until next time, I will see you guys. Oh! Well, I guess, let me know what part of the costume that you would like for me to make sure that I film. You see the costume, you've seen it, let me know. I will see you guys next time. Bye!